hi, my name's Shelby and recently I've bought quite a few items for my hamsters so I thought I'd put a haul video together. I've been watching quite a few haul videos on YouTube lately and I thought I'd make my own. So I have my first ever Viavet order, I'd never ordered from them before and I'm very impressed with not only the prices but the products on there. And then I've got a pet at home order and also a couple of other items in there but we'll get to those soon. So I'm going to start with the Viavet order. Okay, so the first item from Viavet is this, which is a little puzzle playground set. But this one is uh, to make a little seesaw. I do have another puzzle playground set already, so I'm pretty sure the pieces will fit together with this anyway. So yeah, that's my first item. The next item is something I'd actually been looking for for a while, but they were quite expensive in a lot of places, so I was avoiding getting one. But I finally bought a little carrier thing. This one is a rosewood one. It is quite small, but at the same time I got this one because I'd have to find somewhere to keep it all the time, so a massive one wouldn't help. And obviously they're not going to be here very long, so I think this is perfectly fine for hamsters. Next up I bought a little chew toy, and this is the board and breaker wooden roller. Um, this is the watermelon one. I know there were a couple of options there. I can't remember what the other fruit was, but yeah, I got the watermelon one. The next things in here are also ones where you ordered it and you got like a surprise. You couldn't pick out of the options, but I think I did pretty well. Um, for example, this thing, the board and breaker, plane climb. Um, I got, I don't know if you can see from the options down there. Okay, so next up is also another one that was um, options you didn't get to pick, but I think I did pretty well there. I got the strawberry, um, so this was either a strawberry pear or an orange. I didn't really mind <laughs> which, but I, what I do like about um, this is it doesn't have a bottom to it, which is going to make it so much easier to clean, so I'm happy with that. The final item from Viavet is this, another little hide, this is a little hippo one. Um, I don't think this is big enough for Syrians, but I'm sure my robo will enjoy this. Before I get into the pets at home stuff, I am just going to show this. So this is bedding I've never used before. This is the KT Clean Cozy. Um, I bought this one basically because it's cheaper than buying Carefresh from Pets at Home. So I was going to give it a go. And it's also um, got a nice pattern to it, which I'm not going to lie, it did sway me a bit. Okay, so now on to the pets at home stuff. I have currently got it all in this little box. Now this is what the hamster pet parcel came in. Now this was a Christmas thing and it was basically you got a bunch of Christmas items in here. You didn't know what it was, it was like another one of those surprise things. So I bought one of those basically to save me picking out my own and it also was going to work out a bit cheaper for the more items I got. So yeah that's why I got that but not everything in here was in that parcel. So I'll do the things that weren't in that parcel first and I'll do that parcel at the end because they are all Christmas items. We have a couple of chews first. This donut one. And I love these, these are so cute, look, these little dinosaurs. I did buy a couple of these treat things. So there's an apple one and what's the other one? Dandelion, two carrot and dandelion sticks. Um, these are quite big and they do have like a plastic rod that runs through them um, to clip them onto wire cages. I don't have wire cages. So they would just go in on the floor on their own and I do worry they would chew on the plastic. Um, I definitely know my Syrian would so I'm not too sure about those. I might try and break bits off or something. But I do think the treat as a treat they are quite large to leave in there. I don't want to suddenly come back and they've eaten the whole thing and I'm not keeping an eye on them. So yeah, I'll definitely either put them in the cage and keep an eye on them or break some bits off. Next is a little, a little random item that's not from Pets at Home, but this is a little tea light holder that I put in there. And this one was from the range. I think it was like a pound. It was in their Christmas section. Um, so I bought it. I thought I could put it in a Christmas cage and use it as like a little treat bowl. Okay, so next up, this is a Christmas item. It wasn't in the Pets parcel thing, but I just bought this on top anyway because I liked it so much. And it's this little train. So it is um, advertised as a Christmas thing, but I think it, it, yeah, okay, it's red and green and trains are a little Christmassy, but it would work any other time anyway. Now it is quite a small um, tube, so it definitely wouldn't work for Syrians, but my Robo is gonna get this, and I just think it's super cute. 
Right, now on to the pets parcel itself. So there's one, two, three, there's four items in here. Um, I'll go from most boring to the best. <laughs> so um, first is these little berry treats. I've never used these ones before. The next item I do like, and these are little Christmas tree chews. And um, they're just wooden chews, shaped like Christmas trees. So next up we have this, and it's tangled. And there we go. And it's this little fire cone garland. Uh, it has fire cones and little wooden chews. So I think this will definitely go to my Syrian because she is in the IKEA Detolf and I can hang this from the top of that and yeah she'll probably really enjoy that and finally my favourite item in the whole thing is this it's a little fleece penguin look how cute that is now these are quite expensive on their own but I do think they are super cute okay so that's all the items I got I seem to have got through them really quickly there was a lot there um, but yeah, I really enjoyed buying all those items. I get really excited about buying my hamsters new things. I just find it really therapeutic to buy them lots and see them enjoy new toys is super cool. So yeah, some of those will definitely be going in their next cages. So that's it for me today. If you did like this video, please give it a like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.